Hello, this is Gav from my Radio Metro, and today we are going to get into the Never legitimately. Now, I've been searching around on YouTube, and there's a lot of videos of people in the end and people spawning stuff in to get into the end, but I thought I'd show you guys just how to get into the end just by normal kind of hardcore methods. So here we are. I was lucky enough just to mine straight through into this stronghold. I'll put the seed in the description. And um, yeah, and I was quite lucky just to get really near the uh, portal. And my first advice to you is to get rid of this spawner because so much here fish they'll they'll push you off. So to get into the end, you will need twelve Ender pearls, um, which can be found from Endermen, and they're not a hundred percent drop and six blaze rods, there you go, there's the caption, and they're not 100% either, and they can be found in the nether from blazes. So, um, first we will kill an enderman. Uh, so, here we are. Here's an enderman, it's the last enderman I need, I've got 11 ender pearls. Um, and they're really annoying to kill, so I suggest uh, an iron sword, I've got a diamond sword, um, a diamond or iron uh, armor, any armor is better than none in the, at the end of the day and it's also really helpful because a lot of the other mobs attack you and my advice is just to get as many wax in as possible don't use bows because uh, they just dodge the uh, bullet before it is possible to hit them and there it is and then should show you in a second I've got 12 ender pearls uh, yep yeah, I'll just get away from those mobs they're stuck in a creeper hole typical uh, yep, yeah, so 12 ender pearls and that's all you need, just, um, they're quite hard to find, so just keep at it and you will find enough. And to get into the nether, of course we need to get a nether portal, so just, uh, can't remember how many granite bricks it is, but just, um, put them there. Obsidian bricks, and anyway, I said granite. Um, and now we are in the nether, um, their blazes can be found in fortresses and especially around spawners which uh, are found in the fortress and just go in there and attack them with bows this is what I um, think that you should do bows with um, blazes so it's needed to have both and also I really do recommend the deep potion of fire effect because I would not be able to get anywhere near here than if it wasn't for that and I think I've got um, six blaze rods now, and I'm just killing these just purely for fun. There's the fire resistant potion of fire resistance, and that is all you need. Oh, and someone's attacked me from behind, so I'll just get rid of it. Oh, look, and he's dropped another one. Thank you very much, Blaze. Uh, so we are back at the stronghold, and First you need to get the blaze rods, put them into your crafting four slot and create blaze powder. And then you combine the ender pearls and the blaze powder, 12 of each, to create the eyes of the ender. Then you then place them on each block. Be careful not to place two on one block, otherwise you will have to get more blaze rods and then ender pearls, which is annoying um, at, at best. Um, and then it creates this shiny portal, so I'll just jump into this. Take a run up. Boom. Well, that was, that was dramatic. And um, now, come prepared. You will need an iron, uh, uh, at least an iron pickaxe. Any kind of pickaxe. I'm pretty sure, just get a diamond one or an iron one. Probably an iron one. And uh, lots of arrows, which stupidly I didn't bring any arrows. Um, look, he's glitched out just over there. You'll probably be able to see that if you put 1080p on. Yes, this video is there either world in HD. And um, yeah, there's no way out, I don't think. I'm, I'm not quite sure on that one, but I'm pretty sure there's no way out until you kill the boss. And there's plenty of other videos on YouTube uh, to get kill, how to kill the dragon in the end. So I'll just jump off. Thank you.